Hello everyone! Thank you for joining me here, I'm Mr. Mocha Lover, and Slava Ukrayini to you, my fellow viewers. So, right now, this is a mess. You are seeing a giant mess on screen. Now, I'm gonna clarify at the beginning here, that yesterday's video was cut a little bit short, because I was supposed to add in about five more minutes, but... OBS, Open Broadcast Software, it just crashed as I was continuing to record, so... Yesterday's video was a little bit shorter. Regardless, we're still here and we're at war with Austria. Now, um, obviously now you can see that Germany's at war with Austria, but we ourselves have been taking a ton of attacks. It's been insane the amount of attacks that we've had to suffer. And uh, yeah, over here we've lost a good chunk of what we conquered from Bulgaria. That it's been nuts. It's been just crazy doing this. Um, obviously we're at war with the Dona, entire Dona Adria Boon. Makes, makes sense, which includes Poland. Uh, Germany, basically, within the last, like, five, or really the last minute, actually joined the war against the Austrians, so, yeah, the Germans didn't put a lot of soldiers on their border, so they're retreating some soldiers from the border with the Entente over here um, to help defend their own natural borders, because, actually, Germany and the Reichspact, without me, though, is at war with the Japanese, and that's not very good for us. So, the Reichspact is at war with the Japanese, except for me, and I'm holding them back with my border because I don't want to be at war with the Japanese. That's a waste of time for me. I don't really want to do that. Um, yeah, not bad, not bad. So yeah, that's basically where we're at, and I will show you the casualties now. Like I said to some people yesterday, the Austrians and the Romanians, they've literally suicided themselves into my line. So, I've suffered a quarter million casualties. Turkish states lost 200,000, pretty much. A good chunk of the Reich's Pact is not in the war against the Dona Adria Boom, but as you can tell on the right side, they've lost over 6 million men. And it's only been like 3 months. The Austrians have lost over 4.4 million men just by suiciding into my lines. And over 1.2 million Romanians have lost their lives as well in pointless attacks. Like, it's been insane. And I did lose maybe just like a, a few tiles over here, maybe one tile. But Bulgaria, it's been extremely hard to hold on to this territory. It's been very, very hard to hold on to. Wow, they're doing a lot of damage. They do have air superiority, which is an unfortunate thing for the most part. In some areas, we're holding okay, especially in the Ukraine, or Ukraine. But, uh, my goodness, my giddily gosh. Hopefully now that the Germans are in the war, officially now, because they weren't for a while. I didn't, I specifically did not call them into the war, but for now, um, yeah, I... I told, decided not to call in the Germans just because I knew they didn't have any troops on the border. But you know what? The Germans came in. So, I did split apart, like I said before, Italy into several parts. Sardinia got Turin, or this part of Piedmont. Um, no, I'm not going to fight the Japanese right now because I can't do that. Because you're literally retreating all your divisions on the border between me, of course, and the Japanese to help me fight the Austrians. But... Apparently, Sardinia became Sardinia Piedmont, which I thought was pretty darn cool to see. Pretty darn cool. Um, other than that, not much else has happened, really. Really not much else. So, I've just been trying to hold out as best as possible against this insane amount of Austrian firepower. It's just been nuts. And, oh, I should show you that the Austrians, they're out of manpower on scraping the barrel. They have potentially over a thousand divisions. So that's why they've been kind of crazy. The Romanians... Uh, they're out of manpower on scraping the barrel as well, which is great, which is really, really great. So, honestly, with them attacking me like crazy, I am a little inclined to attack them right in the butt. Pablo, do you have anything for me? No. Uh, generals in general. They potentially have upgrades, but nothing really worth it. So, cool. Ooh, Anton. Oh, yes. We'll definitely take that. Thank you. Thank you very much. So they stopped attacking us, and I'm going to do this move, and we'll see what happens. We don't have air superiority, really, but using these divisions, see if we can break some of these guys. Now, obviously, using this type of 40 combat with division, 11 infantry battalions, and 6 artillery isn't super ideal, especially attacking over river, but we are fairly experienced against these guys, compared to these guys, but I don't think we're really going to be able to break across the river, just because the organization on my artillery, especially fighting over river, really isn't good. Even though we are melting some of these enemy divisions. You know, I guess I wouldn't call it melting, but they're doing alright. 
cool. Um, we took this tile back, which is great, because I want to push these guys over the river down. Oh, goodness gracious. Yeah, no. I'm going to keep pushing you back. Especially with these tanks that I made. Um, yeah, this area is a mess. It's a giant flipping mess. But Austria is fighting on pretty much every single front, which is good. Which is very good for us. Uh, obviously, we didn't win down here. I kind of figured that would happen. Not really a big deal. Uh, just... Uh, the only way we're going to win is to bleed Austria dry, which is unfortunate, but... Ooh. Can you actually move in here? Maybe you might be able to. Give me you. Well, hold on. There you go. See if you can help. Oh, nope, you can't move up that way. That's alright. See if you can attack that way. Um, yeah, it's been crazy. It's just been crazy. Ooh. Six subs, but we have an extra cruiser here. We gotta keep an eye on our fuel, though. It looks like there's not too many ships in the Black Sea, so we're gonna take this guy off for now. Go ahead and repair it, even though you really don't need it, because I need to think of my fuel. Awesome. Uh, we might win up here. I did change my motorized division, my single motorized division, to become 40 combat with, but I've also began putting on some mechanized infantry. Good stuff, I know. Very good stuff. We're making some more Coast Guard divisions, some thick Turkish divisions. Infantry template 4. I gave up on this 20 combat with infantry division. Just go 40 combat with, with some very, very thick artillery. Probably too thick. Probably too much artillery, to be honest with you. Ooh, we're getting it. No, we're attacking down here. Actually, could you actually push these Greeks out? No. And that's okay. Really, I knew Bulgaria, or Turkish Bulgaria, would be a good area for us to make a ton of battles to drain the Ottomans, drain the Ottomans, drain the Austrians. I knew that would happen, so I'm not really concerned about that. The Austrians coming through southern Germany-ish, normal parts of Germany. Poland is definitely, oh, that's not good. Poland is definitely exerting its dominance, which is fine, to be expected. Uh, let's do this again. And actually, we're going to throw in our regular infantry this time. They're only 20 combat width, which probably isn't ideal to throw this direction. But my goal is to really, hopefully, do as much damage as I possibly can to those enemy divisions. Their strength level, even though ours is kind of going down, so is theirs a little bit. So that's really probably the most important thing. Throw on a few more divisions. If I can break across the river, that's really the most important thing here. And I know there's too many divisions to really do anything here. But, uh... No, the number went up a little bit. That's always good. And when once these divisions tire out, I'm going to throw on a few more. Um, who's kind of strong here? Yeah. Go ahead and do that. You can come this way as well. Very nice. Oh yeah, look at those divisions. They're not doing so well now. Awesome. When in doubt, recycle your divisions. Uh, throw me another one division this way. So we can continue to cycle. We already took out half of these divisions down here, which is awesome. Good, good, good. If we can break over the river, that's an extremely good thing. Awesome. Good job, guys. Good job. Hold on. Hold on to your butts. Hold on to your, those booties. Great. Now, Poland is trying to get thick, like we said. But, uh, we're going to make sure that Poland remains a little, little tiny state in Europe. All right. 50% party popularity, 63% stability, 74% war support. Not bad. Could get some more war support. Uh, Chief of the Air Force, I'll probably do that instead. We're still suppressing our subjects, which is doing a great job. Let our guys redevelop the line. We're getting attacked in the south again, which is kind of okay with me, just because I want to make sure that I can kind of bait the enemy, bait the Austrians and their allies to attack me. But yeah, that's a lot of losses. I'm sorry if Kaiser Karl is spilling Ukrainian blood, but it's not my fault. It's, it's Kaiser Karl's fault. I mean, he's the one constantly attacking, so... I'm just trying to liberate them. Uh, we probably can't win here. The number is going down a little bit. Yeah, we got like no organization. Georgia, you want to give me your divisions. How many do you got? 29. Uh, you know what? I'll take those 29 divisions. I don't know where they're all at. Oh, they're all over here, looks like. Um, ooh, these are 18 combat width. 18 combat width. That's not terrible. I'll split you in half. Make it... Another army. Put you over here. Good. Um, Y'all go need generals, so I'm glad I have at least a little bit of political power for Vladimir Zavol Zavoyko. Awesome. Um, I'm going to put you up in the north, actually. 
help defend at least this part of Europe. That'll be good. Alright, so we've landed over here, and we're going to continue to exploit to this direction. Please send in the artillery. That's the only way that... Oh, we have enough piercing to pierce them. Nice. And we might be able to shatter some of these enemies. 67%, 65. Come on, 64. Even though organization is going down. I found this to be fairly an okay-ish method to use when attacking our enemies. Nice. We're going to get this port. I think it's a port. Yeah, it is a port. Nice. Good job, guys. Yeah, this is the same strategy that I used against uh, the Commune of France to let Germany win. So, we got our divisions up there. Very nice. Holding strong. Oh, we actually took that province. Very nice, guys. Good job. Good job, guys. Um, yeah. Uh, they're still attacking us like crazy. Oh, no. We're actually, our allies are... Oh, Turkish guys. Come on, man. Um, it looks like I could probably improve the infrastructure around here. Let's do that. Uh, Burgess seems to be okay. not okay. Do that. And for now, I'm going to do construction repair just because we're probably going to need that. Awesome. Because I need to just... The Turkish-Bulgaria region just needs to hold. That's pretty much it. All I want them to do is just to hold, hold, hold. Do I have any extra planes right now? Uh, carrier fighter planes, Mark 1s. I guess they'll suffice for now. Um, no thank you. No thank you. No thank you. Oh, oops, that was convoy stuff. Whatever. Naval bombers. Yeah, we don't have enough fighters for this type of stuff. I'll take another naval bomber, though. You guys doing a great job. Go to the Black Sea, if possible. Great. Alright. Is there anywhere... Oh, baby. You're attacking with quite a few divisions. It You might be able to break this group here. Maybe. I doubt it, but maybe. Alright, gotta get these more divisions down in Romania. Because we're actually probably going to claim once we're done here in Bessarabia. Sorry, I don't feel like opening up the... Uh, yeah, still Empire of Japan. I don't want to open up my front that's completely undefended Germany. So, no thanks, man. No thanks. Mm, yeah, I just got to improve infrastructure here. Supply is really bad. So, anywhere else we could attack? Probably right here. I'm going to send the infantry this time. Pause it. Do this. Give me half of you guys. Attack this way. Um, you might be able to win. I hope you'll be able to win. Oh, as you are all getting attacked, that's why I sent... Kept three right there. Awesome. You're doing a great job, guys. Anywhere else? You might win here. Hopefully you'll win there. Um, anywhere else in the north? These guys are getting attacked. Are you helping? Oh, you're attacking up here. Actually, yeah, that's not a bad idea. We. That's good to help them there. Nope. I'm not helping you there. Um, yeah, just hold the line up the north. That's probably for the best. Anything in the south? Supplies are very, very bad. Right now, we are out of guns, so we need a few more guns. Yep, a few more. Mm, we got enough support equipment so that I could probably take off a little bit more. Do that. Put it back on eventually, though. Good. The game is pretty laggy if you can't tell. And I'm still taking up some more of the German resources so I can get some more of their own territory because they don't need that. They don't need Russian territory. And you know what? I do. Thank you very much, Germany. I appreciate your contribution to the war effort. Thank you very much. Alright, so the, the front is mostly sold out, but then again, we weren't really trying to advance too hard. Good job, guys. Continue killing all of those enemies. Five million losses. Jesus Christ. So many dead. Yeah, don't attack here unless you're really ready. Guys, yeah. Oh, we actually won here. Very nice. Good job, guys. Um, so that means... All of uh, you, a couple divisions, are going to attack this way because their motorized don't look very strong. We're taking back proper Ukrainian lands. Hmm. I can move my tanks around, maybe. My tanks are all surrounding here. This is causing a little bit of a supply issue. I doubt my tanks could really punch a hole through these guys right now. There's only three divisions versus this many. Yeah, no. They're causing a lot of supply issues, so I'm going to take them out here. Really? There's nowhere good for me to place it. I'm going to put them in Gallipoli for now. Get them off the line. Maybe that'll help supply with for everyone else. So, I'm going to try that. 
get rid of them. They might actually hold a little bit better if they actually aren't losing a supply or taking too much attrition. Alright, so this looks like a weird place we might be able to attack right here. Thank you. And you'll help attack over the river as well. Now, this is 17 divisions. Obviously, we're only attacking with 9. But my goal is to just continue to destroy as many... Or destroy the strength of all these enemy divisions. Just destroy them as best as possible. You already tired yourself out, so do that. You guys come over here and do that. Oh, and the, our allies are attacking. Good. Um, artillery is getting weak up in the north. That's fine. You already canceled yourselves out. That's okay. Keep the battle going on because this will give us enough time for our artillery to resume its duties. Very nice. We're doing a great job. Blow them all to hell. And we'll never see him again. Oh, look at those. Oh, there you go. Good job, boys. Good job. Divisions. Some more Turkish divisions. Thank you. Yes, please. Put them on the line, because we don't like supply around here for some reason. Radar. Ooh. Look at all this radar I built. Very nice. I do that. Anywhere else I can put... Maybe a little bit more supply through that could be good. That would probably be most beneficial. Good. Oh, up here. I don't think I was attacking this spot, but... I don't mind helping allies out if I can help them out, maybe. Continue throwing on lots and lots of artillery pieces. An ace pilot was promoted. Very good. Very, very good. Um, up here, they're kind of losing it. You might need to help them out a little bit. Yes, very good. The Romanians will not be able to get enough supply through here. Uh, the Austrians' attack have obviously stopped. They took a little bit of southern Germany. Not very much, just a little bit. Ooh, Turks. I'll take some stuff. No, thank you, Serene Republic of Venice. Oh, the Germans are actually doing a great job attacking. Of course, when do they never... When do they not attack? Like, be real here. Venice is doing okay-ish as well. They took Trieste, which Austria contained or held a little bit earlier. And I'm joined here by my cat named Binky. I didn't even recognize that my black cat was sleeping on my black chair. What a beautiful animal. Truly one of the best. Um, cool. We're actually doing pretty well up here. Help them out up there. Should have enough divisions to hold for now. Just an insane amount of losses. So, um, Regarding this campaign, I want to let you know, guys, that this campaign will be wrapping up within the next few days. Uh, tomorrow, we should be able to finish up the Austrian campaign, because I'm going to probably play this a little bit off of screen. And after that, we'll go to war as quick as I can against Germany. So we'll see what happens with that. So yeah, this campaign will be wrapping up within three, four days. So Just to let you guys... I'll be aware on what is going on, especially with my channel, which by now you should know that I've uploaded a new campaign from a new game. So that's very cool. Alright, supply should be doing better down here. Level 7, not terrible, not bad. These guys are going to be hard to get rid of. The Greeks, how much manpower? They have no manpower on scraping the barrel. The Albanians have a little bit of manpower on scraping the barrel. The Serbians have. What? A little bit of manpower on scraping the barrel, and Austria is still without manpower, which I love, 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 love. Love it. Um, yeah, don't attack when you're not ready. Come on. It's, it is 1947, so the game is fairly laggy. You guys seem to be doing a great job of attacking over the river. Thank you very much, Germany. And then I'm going to go ahead and attack as soon as you guys are done. Thank you. Give them no rest. Give them no quarter. Throw some divisions this way. Thank you. Thank you very much. Um, we could probably attack here next, but I want to make sure that we have enough infantry equipment because we're lacking just a little bit right now in terms of infantry equipment. You guys are doing okay. Attacking Poland. It's kind of a fortress Poland right now. That's all right. The Italians, though. Jesus Christ. You're going crazy. and You're like the, you're like the Germans. Going crazy. They got a lot of manpower, so I guess they can go crazy. Economic miracle under Umberto Merlin. Oh, we're getting attacked over here. That's really, really not good. Um, three divisions are trying to hold out against 12, so we're probably going to lose that. But as long as we can slow down their advance, that's really my goal in this part of the area. This part of the country. Come on, you guys should be able to make it up there, hopefully. Oh, maybe not. If not... Yeah, they're throwing on as many divisions as possible. 
Um, I don't know about that. Tactical Bomber 3 is very nice. It's almost 1948. I need to research jet engines for better stuff, so we got to do experimental rockets next. Tactical Bomber 3s. Hello there. Give me more reliability, a little more range, a little more bombing. Nice. Oh, we got, we need a little bit more agility. Take off the range a little bit. Uh, not bad, not bad, not bad. Oh, we need more agility for that, so take off the range. Oh, we need more agility. Wait, even need more agility? What the heck? That's a little bit better. That doesn't, okay, that's not bad. Alright, cool. Tactical Bomber 3s, thank you very much for playing. I will use you next. Nope, nope, nope. Yeah, go ahead and hold. You don't need to do that. Go ahead and hold. This is all just a distraction down here. I would hate to be a soldier in Turkish Bulgaria right now. Oh, Germany, why are you attacking like this? It's really not the smartest idea to attack right now when your soldiers really aren't ready. But how much motorized do we have? We got a lot of motorized, so I don't feel bad about doing this. Switching this to mechanized, 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 mechanized. You're not mechanized. You are mechanized. And then... You're going to join the club. Make that one division we have a little bit stronger. Awesome. Uh, you know, if they're attacking here, uh, that might be an okay place to attack. I know they have a lot of divisions, and I don't want to you know, sacrifice too many lives around here, but we do what we must. Alright, anywhere else they are attacking. It looks like the, the supply situation has gotten a little bit better around here. Burgas, Burgas... Um, you know what? Put some forts around here. They're probably going to attack this tile up here soon. But that's pretty normal. Pretty darn normal. Oh, come on, Germany. Stop attacking when you don't need to attack. I don't mind helping you in places like this, though. That's not a good idea to attack. Right here would probably be the best. Right here isn't bad either. Do that right there. Mm, love them wouldn't be bad. Oh, good job, guys. You actually pushed into here. Great. Oh yeah, also, uh, we have Sweden and Norway. I didn't tell you that because I forgot about it. So we have Gustav V leading Sweden and Norway because I gave Norway to Sweden when the war against the Third International is over. So that's kind of interesting. And we also have the British Reconstruction Authority. So this isn't Führerreich, but this is, of course, Kaiserreich. And the British are trying to reconstruct themselves in the UK. Mechanized equipment. Awesome. Um, support companies... Uh, yeah, let's do logistics, because we could really, really use that wherever we're at right now. Um, mechanized stuff, thank you. Thank you for playing. Yes, attacking through the mountains was never such a bad idea. Especially in Carpathia. Oh, that's going to be terrible to fight through. Oh, that supply situation is definitely getting better. Alright, what is a plane situation like? Pretty bad, wherever we're attacking. We don't ha definitely don't have enough planes to contest the Austrians, but... That's pretty much to be expected. It looks like down here we can maybe attack again. Oh, Yeah, let the Germans finish off here first. Get my infantry ready to go. Let the Germans fail. Come on, give up, Germany. Nope. Oh, good job, Germany. You attacked Jassy, and that was great. Or Yassi. Uh, it looks like they're not going to give up. Just help them attack right now. German, we can. The Germans are going to pierce those enemies. Come on. Yeah, help, help the guys out. Help them out right now. We got the infantry in there. That's great. Come on, you guys got this. You're only going to be murdering a bunch of these people because they decided to go to war with us. That's what happened, right? That's what really happened. They totally went to war with us first. It's not just like I'm trying to reclaim Ukrainian lands. No, of course not. Um, you guys might be able to win here, maybe? Oh, look at those. Oh, wow. They're actually doing not a bad job. The organization is definitely going down, especially for this mechanized division and this militia. But even this Austrian divisions, they don't have enough supplies. Now, we don't have enough guns. Never mind, we do. But, uh, very nice. Oh, the Germans are actually assaulting them. Nice. Good job, guys. Good job. Oh, what time is it? i got to keep an eye on time, because I'm going to be leaving here today sometime. Not sure when yet, but... Must always keep an eye on time. No, no, thank you. I don't fight, feel like fighting the Japanese right now. Not really in the mood for it, but maybe later. Maybe later. Um, yeah, let you guys rest up a little bit. Then we're going to do another attack right here, Germany. Come on. Oh, no, that's White Ruthenia doing it, the business. All right. Oh, Italy is really trying to push hard. Or should I say Venice? 
Unless the Germans are down here in Bosnia and Croatia and stuff like that. No, it's mostly Italians. Both two Sicilies as well as the, the Serene Republic of, of Venice. And no, thank you, Germany. Uh, no, oh, we still have two nukes, but obviously I don't have enough uh, air superiority to do anything here. And the game is lagging very hard because it's trying to probably autosave. Cool. You guys are up next. Give me half of you guys. You're going to attack this way as well. Give me... Ooh, artillery. Hello there. Please do the best job you can. Please melt enemy divisions. 30% strength. 28% strength. Um, I'd like a little bit lower strength. 26. That's pretty good. That's not bad. Keep doing what you're doing. 24%. I love it. Please melt them as best as possible. Because we don't need Austria to get more soldiers. No, 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 no. Oh, yeah. Look at that. It's going down. It's going down. Oh, no. Oh, beautiful. Go ahead and hold. You don't need to move. All right. Um, just help them out. I mean, yeah. Uh, double up on your efforts there. Um, take the artillery. Help attack this way as well. Guys, I'm sorry. I'm not not interested. I'm really not interested, man. Um, you guys are trying to attack. The front down here is definitely stalled out, which isn't great, but, you know, whatever. Um, radar's doing okay. We have enough radar down here. We bought up some radar over here, which is really more than enough. And we can even build up even more radar now, which I love. I love radar. I probably love it too much. Um, right there. That's probably all the radar stuff that we really need to do. We have one up here. Yeah, that's that's a lot of radar. I'm not going to lie. That's a lot of radar. Seven divisions. They're not doing anything. Well, they need to get attacked then. Um, looks like the Germans are winning over here, or whoever's winning over here. Help them out. Push them hard. Push them back in. That would be great. Alright, very good, very good. Not doing a terrible job. Casualty report. We killed almost 4 million Austrians. Just from ourselves. And the Germans have basically killed a million themselves too. And Venice has killed nearly a million... Austrians as well. Truly a beautiful thing. Um, where else can we attack? Right here, obviously, with the Germans. We will help them out. You give me half of y'all. Come attack this way, and they won't know what hit them. Good, 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 good. Uh, you might as well, you might want to help them out there. Maybe give you half of you guys. Help attack there. Good stuff, man. Good stuff. How's the German East Indies holding up? They got pretty darn thick. They have, I gave them all of, like, Siam and uh, Thailand and stuff like that, so. That's a lot of guys. Um, Insula Insulindian Federation is part of the Code Prosperity Sphere, and they've been kicking out the German East Indies over here, but, you know, whatever. Not bad. Yeah, I just don't want to go to war with Japan right now. I don't really have any divisions over here. And this is a, kind of a thick Code Prosperity Sphere. And the game is pretty laggy, so don't really want to mess that up too much. Um, Germany, you are attacking like crazy. You are attacking too crazily. I don't approve of this, Germany. I really don't. But sometimes it might be okay if you can take Bohemia. Nice. Very, very good, my friends. Very, very good. Uh, yeah. Yeah, the strength is so low here that you might be able to just decimate these divisions for a long, long time. Yeah, keep doing that. I don't want to do this, but send the divisions in as well to help out, help the Germans out. Um, but we're not going to be too crazy. Help them out here, help them out here. Um, not bad, not bad. You guys, uh, I guess try to help them out, I suppose. Yeah, melt those divisions. Now attacking in the south, which I'm kind of surprised, but I guess I guess I'm not really surprised, just because the Austrians are losing equipment and manpower all over the place. So, oh yes, please attack, please attack my artillery. That'd be a great thing for you all. Uh, we have an artillery division that can help out this direction. Good, awesome, looking pretty good, looking pretty darn amazing, guys. So, Venice, you're doing a great job. I don't want to give you territory after this, so. We'll see what you get. You might not get anything. You might just be a German puppet. I don't know. 
Poland, we definitely want Poland. Hmm. I really wish the battles in this area would continue to spark back up, but it doesn't look like it. Kind of disappointing that they haven't attacked over here either. I thought they would, but, you know, I'm not right about everything. Whatever. Whatever. Uh, artillery, where are you going? No, you can just come come through the, that way. You guys can probably come out and help kill off these guys. You guys can probably come this way. You guys can probably come this way. And we're having a great time with each other overall. It's February 1948. Happy 1948, everyone. But that's pretty much all the time that we have for today. So tomorrow, what we will do, I will show you a further pushed on campaign into Austria. I will show you how I defeat them. Or how, I guess, our allies will help defeat them. And prepare for an invasion, hopefully, of the German Empire, which might require me to take out Japan, but I might just leave the faction just because I want to. Anyways, thank you very much for watching, guys. Leave a like if you like the video. Subscribe if you're new. I apologize for all the Ukrainian losses that Kaiser Karl is causing, and I hope you all have a great, great day.